another thing that I am not looking forward to doing. I hate, this is the thing I hate the most about this motor. There's a pin in here. There's a lot of videos on YouTube on dealing with this, but there's only one way to deal with it. Uh, and that's to, um, well actually, huh, since we got the flywheel off, what if we just punched it out that way? Ooh, bent that, so. I don't think that's meant to come out, guys. Got a nail here, nice, nice big nail. Anything to try to get this stinking thing doing the way it's supposed to. You know my needle nose pliers that I'm always forgetting that I go fishing? You know, I don't ever, they're not forgotten. They were just in the bag. <laughs> so all this time you guys been wondering, man, are you gonna this dude keeps forgetting pliers. They're, they're just in the bag. They were just in the bag and they were just so they were just down in there really well. I hadn't forgotten anything. They're just in a different part of the bag than I normally kept them, you know. This is a booger. Quit messing around and give us a serious motor, right? That's exactly what the guys at the box stock project are doing. Getting motors, importing motors specifically for racing. I've always wondered if I could get motors imported specifically for mud motoring uh, with the exact type camshaft, all that kind of stuff. That's, and maybe just buy the motor motors you know, in kit form where you guys could just take them and build them yourselves. You know, so, I don't know. I may just keep on shooting just to show you how stinking much of a problem. Just do a long shoot just to show you how much of a problem this clip is. And how incredibly stupid Show you just how much I hate this thing. Just keep shooting, you know. Okay. Tell you one thing, they didn't mean for it to come out. That's what it is. And you know, and in all respects, you know, the uh, the governor's gonna make you run at lower RPM, which basically means you're gonna save the motor over the long term and that's probably what the company's thinking about if they're going to have to insure the motors or get you know product insurance or not so much that but just you know returns and things like that if you have just a simple plastic little governor gear that slows the motor down on purpose then then you don't have customers coming back saying things like oh you know motor blew up well, yeah, if you're running it at 8,000 RPM, you only need to be running it at like six or, or five or six. Um, you know. Okay, so I think I have, uh, if you can get the clip there, I've made a little progress. Well, not really. I wanna know. Have you ever seen the rain? I don't know why I've been listening to a bunch of Credence tunes lately, man. <laughs> Credence, baby! <laughs> My goodness. But, motors are a lot. Ah! Dang it! Ever known people who just drive around the neighborhood just to drive around and you're like, whoa. Almost. I think that almost got it. Dude! I think we got it, man. It moved a heck of a lot more. If you can get the uh, screwdriver under the clip slightly and then pry up some, I think it, like that. I don't see how guys, these young guys, I mean, they've managed to just 
do it while the crankshaft and, and the piston and stuff were in it. I'm like, how in the world? You see how much trouble I'm having? Go look at some of those videos on removing the governor from a 212cc Predator. You'll see guys being able to take it out. I'm like, what the heck are they doing? I just don't get it. Oh. Okay, there, there it is. There it is. That, that's it. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Here we go. Here we go, guys. Um, I think that got it. Don't want it to slip back down. Okay. If we can get this off, dude, this would be like. Ah! You want to see what's caused us all this trouble? Huh? There it is. That little clip. Right there. All this trouble for that stupid little thing right there. Now, that tells you two things. This is really incredibly well built. And to have a product that well built for that cheap, my gosh, if they just didn't put it in there because we don't need it. <laughs> Disclaimer, guys, when you remove the governor, you have to use a billeted flywheel. Now, that'll come out just fine. Bam, see there? That. Ah. Come on, don't go slipping back down. Magnets beat gravity. This thing is uh, thing that we're sticking to. You can leave that in. That, that won't hurt anything. It's not spinning. It's not going to fall out. Remember, we tried to tap it. It wouldn't budge. So, again, in a, in a way to uh, prevent ruining the crankcase, we just left it in. It, it, nothing's going to hit it. So you can leave that in. That'll be just fine. 